You know what I've seen again with this episode of Mouse Summer Retry? That the show is extremely boring when you don't have your main characters. Like, <laughs> when you have these side characters doing stuff like the freaking Killer Queen and stuff, they were sitting there battling Mink and all that. Mink is kind of funny because she uses Holy Element, although she completely, um, huh. Hmm, best way to put this is she's completely got a screw loose and says everything is darkness, although her element is holy. Anywho, oh man, besides her, the whole side character cast is really dull. Like they're out there fighting and I felt nothing. <laughs> and because of the whole barrier thing and them taking out a little bit of the color in this um episode, you know, when everything barriers. Some of the color wears off. Looks like everything's faded. That's kind of irritating to look at. I'm just gonna be real honest. It's it's not a fun thing to see. So for most of this episode, I was almost sleep. <laughs> like they were fighting that um Prince of Darkness guy, and it was just freaking boring. And I'm sorry to anybody who actually liked that. It was so dull until we hit 15 minutes. When we hit 15 minutes and Kunai did the character change, <laughs> that's when it became interesting again, you know. And it was rather entertaining at that point. But before that, it was just, oh, so bad. But the thing before the middle part of it, was, which was the whole clown assassination thing, that was interesting. It seemed a little fun. You taking off his arms and putting them on or on, that was great. I enjoyed that. But then we got the gray. I'm telling you, it was, it was so sad. Which is... <laughs> uh, the clown pulled out a rose. And I think he kissed the rose. Then we got the gray. Come on, somebody tell me you got that. Hey, uh, kiss, kiss, rose. Uh, gray, no. Uh, okay, whatever, fine. You don't have to get my jokes. You don't have to like my jokes. But I'm still telling them anyway. Anywho. <laughs> we got through part of this episode and then... Oh, he did the character change and came out and easily defeated the Prince of Darkness. Which, um... Stabbed old girl through, the, through her chest and... I don't remember her name. I don't really care. I thought they were about to give her backstory. And then they cut in the backstory. They're like, oh, wait, we're not going to let you have a full backstory here. And just cut into that because we know, we know what's going to happen if we do this backstory. It's going to be boring. Let's cut that. Oh, goodness. But when it started up, when her freaking snowfall backstory started up, it looked almost like an ending theme. <laughs> I was like, this is going to be the new ending theme? I thought the episode was over. I was like, they bored me to death and then just cut the episode. Nope. Oh, man. It was... Oh, it was interesting. And I can say that much for this episode. It was interesting. I was interested in when it was going to end. Because... <laughs> it was so dull. Like, if you take the beginning and the end of it and just cut out all of the middle section, it'd be rather enjoyable. It'd be extremely short, but it'd be rather enjoyable. Oh, man. But yeah, this episode was just, the uh, best way to explain it, it was dull. Ah, oh, man. What a shame. Anywho, that's going to do it for this. Nothing to really talk about here because it was nothing but a fight. One big fight. That was boring. I'll see you guys next time. Let me know what you thought in the comments below. Peace out and have a great day.